Hey everybody, Dustin Briley here with Briley Brothers. Today we are in Gilbert, Arizona, and we're gonna take a look at this four bedroom, three bathroom, single family home. Let's get to it. All right, so this home, I wanted to get out of the wind a little bit, but this home is 2,460 square feet. It was built in 2022 by Taylor Morrison. So obviously it's pretty much brand new. The lot is 7,500 square feet. The HOA is around $117 a month. It's got a two car garage. It's in the community of Morrison Ranch. The cross streets are going to be Warner and Wrecker, and it's listed at $819,000. So if you've never been to Gilbert, Gilbert's one of the more popular cities in the valley. Uh, there's gonna be some of the best schools in the valley. Uh, there's water parks, golf courses. They're building a uh, surf park. Pretty much anything you can think of family oriented is gonna be in Gilbert. Not to mention there is a wonderful downtown with probably 20 restaurants, two parking garages, and uh, just a ton of stuff to do down there. So hey, if you're looking for a wonderful community, Gilbert, Arizona in the East Valley is gonna be a wonderful choice. It's about 30 to 35 minutes away from the airport, and I think you're really gonna like it. So as we walk in, you're gonna notice the tile flooring that uh, has that wood look pattern that's so popular right now. Very low maintenance here in Arizona. You're also gonna notice the very wide walkways as well as the 12 foot high ceilings and then the eight foot doors throughout with the black hinges and door handles. Over here we have a really large laundry room. This is one of the biggest laundry rooms I've seen in this price range ever. We have the laundry room, and then next to that, we have access to the two-car garage. Nice tall ceilings out here as well. And then directly across from that, we're gonna have three of the bedrooms. Let's start over here. So this bedroom faces the front of the house. This one has a walk-in closet as well as his own bathroom. So this is gonna be popular with the kids. We're gonna make a great guest uh, quarters. And this neighborhood is very pretty, very picturesque. So that was bedroom number one. This is bedroom number two. So all the bedrooms have carpet. Bedroom number three, and then they share this bathroom right here. So the two bedrooms share this, and then the other bedroom had its own bathroom. So you do have a, you know, this could be a den, could be a office, could be, you could even put a formal dining room. Kind of had a lot of options with that space right there. And then we flow into the family room. Most likely your TV is gonna go on this wall over here. And then you're gonna have views of the backyard and it's gonna flow right into the kitchen. It's a very white kitchen, white cabinets, white uh, countertops, at least the, uh, the island is gray. So that does a little bit of contrast. It feels like a very clean house because of the paint color and the uh, cabinet choices. They went with the black hardware on the cabinets to match the door handles and hinges. Got the walk-in closet. These are gonna be quartz countertops. You do have the gas cooktop. 
crown molding on top of the cabinets. Lots of cabinets, lots of space. So far, I really like the layout. I really like all the windows and the natural light that comes in. This is obviously where, where you're gonna put one of your tables. And then we have access through the sliding glass door to the covered patio, as well as the unfinished backyard. And as you can see, they are still building. Not much going on back here. You got a blank canvas, plenty of room to put a pool or whatever else you like. And you can see the church right over there in the distance. If you enjoy this type of content, hit that subscribe button. Give us a thumbs up if you're enjoying it as well. And if you need help buying or selling, let us know. My brother and I would love to help you out. We're in the top 1% of all realtors and we'd love to help you buy or sell your next property. All right, now we go into the split living. This is gonna be your primary suite. Nice size bedroom. Probably put your bed underneath those two small windows, views of the backyard, carpet, and then the primary bathroom. Really deep bathtub. I love the bathtub, that's great. Got two sinks. And then a very pretty shower as well. And then the closet, you have some uh, shelves that are so high, you're gonna need a step stool to reach some of those shelves up at the top. And those gotta be 10 feet tall. All right, well, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you have any questions or if you want to see this house let me know our contact information is going to be on the screen as well as in the description and thanks so much for tuning in we'll see you in the next video